Okay, so we've soldiered through the rain. Uh, we just finished things up. We were able to pull the tarp off and actually see for the first time what this whole thing looks like. So there's these kids coming through and they're sneaking, you know, they're kind of looking under the tent and then when it came off, people wanted to get photos with the corn dog and with uh, the ear of corn and the bacon and in front of stuff. Monster trucks and that sort of, those sort of things have been kind of in the language of our imagery for, for a while and so it seemed appropriate for the fair to do a souped up tractor. Uh, this guy is a hand puppet that somebody brought to, uh, I don't know how it showed up, but this is Dennis. We've been joking that Dennis is our muse. He kind of takes on a different personality every time someone puts their hand in him. We blame all our bad behavior and sort of bad impulses on Dennis. He's been uh, pretty rude, pretty funny, and uh, kind of the, our, our source of inspiration for the whole show so far. Well, most of our drawings just compile all this dense information and uh, kind of has a lot of the language that's evolved over the course of our working together. The Hatchet Boy is you know, uh, referential to our existence as this group who does a lot of chainsaw carving and works with wood. Our work, this show, deals a lot with stuff that's referential to the fair. We began to think about what objects would be appropriate, and so of course the corn dog um, dipped in mustard on top of a beer can. I mean, another bunch of dense imagery. And then we have the contortionist on top of the tattooed pig. Uh, I mean, it kind of speaks for itself. We were looking a lot at the, at the circus uh, and carnival posters of, uh, you know, history, and that's what this one's got going on. And then again, uh, Iowa stuff, bacon. Uh, bacon guy wearing cowboy, smoking a cigar. I don't know what else to say about it, but it's pretty much Iowa. And then we have Dennis and Little Bigfoot. We wanted to have him as a character in this, and this was pretty straightforward representation of that. Uh, revisiting some of those historical images, the fat lady with the serpent boy, and uh, some of our inside imagery up above. Corn cop smoking the corn cop pipe. Just another play on the Iowa imagery and having fun with it. From the stage of the, where it went from a drawing to actually uh, building this stuff and painting, things changed constantly. Uh, the, the midway painting, which I'll call it, it started out as this magician guy with a turban hat and it evolved into this thing that was a totem at one point. It probably changed about five times until it got into its final state. Some of these were pretty solid from the beginning. Uh, the carvings, since we had to get the carvings done before the fair started, that all went uh, pretty straightforward, but as soon as you start painting on them, they begin to take on a little more life too. So yeah, it's it evolved and I think the amount of polish that we were able to put on, on this stuff um, really made it come to life and that doesn't happen until the end. 